If you're new to the channel, I do a lot of golf tip and drill videos to get your game in shape in a hopefully fun and creative, exciting, non-boring, traditional golf lesson style of a way. So hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss anything. Let's get to the video. Okay, here's what you need for this drill. Uh, you need to be about 30 yards away from your net, which is out there, it's very important. You can do this at the range. However, I want you to have something very specific at about 30 yards that you're going to hit. That's the key, okay? So, for me, it's my net. Then, get a couple alignment sticks. This is what you're gonna do. I am going to line these up like this. And I want the center of it pointed directly at something, my target. I'm gonna be very, very precise here. I, am, I want the exact center of that ax. So I'm gonna just line those up perfectly. If I put my club down the center, shut one, I mean, I'm, I'm lasering this thing in there. It's perfectly right on the center of that ax. Now, I wanna use a seven iron. Five, six, seven, four, five, six, seven, right in there, but I like a seven. Then I'm gonna hit just pitch shots with my seven iron right into that ax. Now, the key here is to take that club back perfectly straight. I do not want to, if you bring it to the inside too much, the ball is gonna start out too far to the right. Watch. If I bring it in here, It goes a little right, and you can hit that a little heavy too. So we don't want to do that. That's a different shot with the wedge. That's something totally different. If I bring it too far outside, if I come out here, that's no good either. My ball's gonna go way left. So I want to make sure I go straight back, straight through. No, no, wrist motion. I'm not opening that face. I'm just going here and rotate through. Just right to here and rotate my body around. And I want to make sure I hit the net every time. The best I can. I want it to start exactly on that X. So I'm just going to take it straight back right in here and rotate through. My feet are a little more close together here where my feet are, ball's in the center of my stance, hands are slightly forward, just rotating the hips around, and rotate through. Pretty good. This drill is so critical for learning how to take the club back properly on a straight line and then coming through with good rotation and very little hand rotation through impact. We don't want any of that. We want very subtle hands, very subtle wrists. And then all this practice, all this work will translate into your full swing and you'll start firing it straight every single time. But we've got to get this piece down first. So just practice with this type of setup. Maybe you live in a colder climate, this would be perfect. Just, if you've got the space, hit these pitch shots with your seven iron, start grooving that first part of your ball flight. You're gonna groove your backswing, you're gonna groove your follow through, and you're gonna groove your body rotation and your weight transfer as you rotate those hips. So I hit the net, I was a little right. So that means I took it a little too far inside. So I wanna adjust for that. I want it perfect every time. Everything is square. Square shoulders, square hips. Everything matches my alignment sticks. Once I get too far in here, I'm gonna miss a touch to the right. If I take it back 
a little too far outside, I'm gonna pull it a little bit left. If I take it back right in here, I should be good. Always check your club face too to make sure that's perfectly square. Butt it up against the back of the, uh, the mat, just so you know it's perfectly square. And then transfer that to your ball. And you're good. You'll really find that when you work on this area the most, bam, your accuracy increases dramatically. I like a seven iron, a six iron, five iron with this drill. Because look, it's 30 yards. If I hit this 40, 50 yards, it's still gonna be low enough to knock over my fence. So that's good. So that's why I work on this chipping, pitching with these longer mid, mid to long irons so that we really work on that first part of our ball flight. That's critical because that's our swing path. We wanna get that down perfect. Get that swing path down. Then all we have to do is adjust the face a little bit if it starts curving too much. That's easier. But the swing, the swing, adjusting that, getting that going in the right direction, that's a little more difficult. So we wanna make sure we got that down so we know we can start the ball where we're looking every single time. There you go, that's the drill. It's just making sure that we're starting the ball exactly where we're looking every single time. It's gonna help your game tremendously. Comment below, let me know how this drill's working for you. Thanks for watching, hope you liked the video. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video.